Okay, we want to get to your weather because warm, windy. Yeah. What else can we expect in the coming days? We have KCAL News Meteorologist Marquina Brown, who's been tracking this in our next weather forecast. Hi, Marquina. Hey there, ladies. Good evening. So, yeah, it's also going to be very dry, and we are also going to be very mindful of the potential for fire danger because it is going to be dry and windy. Those two elements together are generally not good for us here in Southern California. So, we have red flag warnings, as you can see, that are in effect for LA and Ventura counties mainly. We are talking about very low humidities here. We could get a uh, single digit humidities with this red flag warning. And of course, we'll be watching out for the strong winds as well. That goes into effect tomorrow morning. Relative humidities, let's talk about the drier air. Uh, right now, not too bad in lots of places, but uh, everybody will see these relative humidity numbers drop as we get mainly into tomorrow and Monday, just so you know. In terms of how strong this wind could get and where. Let's talk about it by way of our next weather future cast here. You can see in the oranges, that is some of the strongest winds impacting parts of the basin, parts of Lancaster into our mountains and deserts, the Inland Empire, also parts of Orange County. In these oranges, we are talking about the potential of 30 to 40 mile per hour gusts. Some areas could see isolated 50 and 60 mile per hour gusts. They become more widespread as you can see as we get into tomorrow afternoon. This is going to be a pretty significant Santa Ana wind event. So just be aware of that if you are going to be out and about as we get into Sunday and not only just Sunday, but also Monday as well. Early Monday, we are looking at the wind slowly but surely dying down, but still pretty aggressive in spots. As we take a look at what you should expect seven day forecast wise, here we go looking at numbers that really aren't that bad. In fact, as we get to Tuesday and Wednesday, uh, Halloween and the day after, it's going to be pretty mild days. Numbers are slightly above average, so get ready to hold on to those hats after this wind event moves out. Looks like we'll be pretty good. Ladies, back to you. CBS News Los Angeles, your local news, streaming wherever, whenever.